Yeah. Sounds good though. Is it kind of cold in here? <laughs> no, you're being. All right, guys, bitch. welcome back to the Simple Man Podcast. It's your boy Nikki Rod, Damian Anderson, Ethan Krellenston. Today is a Thursday here in Austin, Texas, and we're here to announce that. What are we announcing? <laughs> yeah, we're announcing that we're going to tell you some, some important information and stay tuned to find out. But first, we're, let's thank our sponsors. Let's, let's thank our sponsors, Massive Supplements. Get all your daily greens and reds with Massive Supplements. All the colors. Greens, all the colors. Smashing reds. Need. Super nutrient-dense foods that you guys can uh, uh, add to your water. Really good for you. Also, Violent Hippie. Uh, Violent Hippie brand keys, USDA soaps and CBD oils. Veteran hats. owned. Yeah, it's a veteran owned. Mitch Aguiar, former Navy SEAL, fucking badass. Um, <clears throat> so thanks to him for uh, sponsoring the podcast. Use code SIMPLEMAN for 10% off both Massive Supplements and Violent Hippie. Just a, an additional shout out, Violent Hippie Academy. All personnel trained for free. You just got to uh, bring a gi, I think. Brady, That's really all good. All person, all all military. Our, no, yeah, no, not everyone. just persons. Everybody yeah. trains for free. They go to. Free it's there. a bad business model. It's not good. <laughs> the nonprofit, nonprofit organization. This, they're, they're, they're the goodwill of uh, of hippies. Violent, That's violent. violent. I mean, how are they still in business? It's not about the money, bro. It's about the pride. Okay. Talk about money. So. so we wanted to make this podcast better for you guys. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, we spent eight thousand dollars on cameras and tripods. And now, it, tell us if it's better. The cameras that we <laughs> bought are sitting in a box behind you. So let us know if it's made any improvements. The people at Best Buy told us that this will this is a great purchase, and uh, we're not being swindled or scammed anyway whatsoever and yeah so pretty much I go, yeah. I go to best buy i'm like all right give me some good podcast cameras right i do a little bit of research i'm like all right sony fx30 that's what i'm going with that's not what we're, we're recording on right now because we're not able to use them but cameras come in and before when i'm talking to best buy people i'm like listen uh i need a camera that has that can record you know for uh, at least an hour and a half two hours so they're like all right no problem fx30 i was like all right i need something that has a lens like attached to it like the one that they're that i'm looking at has a lens on it i'm like does this camera come with a lens they're like yeah absolutely i'm like sick give me three of them they pull the cameras come with no lens uh completely dead and um that was it and lens lens was the big thing yeah. So yeah. eight thousand dollars worth of cameras that we can't use until we buy like another thousand dollars worth then of we lenses. We also have to get like a subscription to filming using those cameras or something. All right, never mind. What? <laughs> it's not funny. <laughs> it's not funny. No. Anyways, please sponsor the podcast so we, <laughs> we can continue. <laughs> Do we need some lenses? Oh, so look, you're colorblind. Why are you colorblind? Tell us about this. What the fuck? I don't know. No, you, like, were you born or it was like some happy you fell down the no, steps? No, no, it, it's a choice. It's a choice. It's a choice. Yeah. It's a choice. Is yeah. it? Is it like a? Uh, are you like non-binary colorblind? Yeah, yeah. I don't. I choose not to see. You the only colors. see they them. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. Okay. We're okay what color is that <clears throat> inside? Uh, it looks green to me. So actually, it's green. <clears throat> How do yeah. you know? It looks green. It could be bro. lying to you. How do you know? Well, it yeah, looks what? green, bro. I don't know. I, I I honestly don't know how it works. My grandfather on my mom's side is colorblind, and he didn't know until I was colorblind. And then, like, my mom was like, "Look, David, he lived can't his see entire this. life not realizing he was colorblind." Wow. Damn. Did he yeah. think he was white? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Maybe I don't know. He grew up in the Philippines, so. Oh no. That'd be wow. a weird one. So he actually. Saw in black and white. No, not black and, and, and white. Gray. I black, can see, white, you gray. can see colors. It's black, just white and gray. shades just fuck it up. Yeah. I don't what even... flavor Gatorade is that right behind you? It looks blue. Oh, All right, you're, you're not good. You're lying to us. Yeah, you're just <laughs> lying. I don't know what to tell you guys. I don't know what to tell you. Tell us the truth. I'm colorblind. I don't. I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. What's that one color you you were saying? Magenta. 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 What the fuck is magenta? <laughs> it's, uh, it's a shade of purple and pink. He's not colorblind. You I can know, know things. I can know it. <clears throat> Fine. Do you I, practice knowing your colors? Because you can't like remember what they are. That's not. That's not. That's not the way it works. <laughs> <clears throat> they just look the color to me. But I think like when they're shades, that they just um, it just flips a little bit. Like if there's a shade of red, right? Like not a bright red. It's like a shade. It it could look green to me. And I wouldn't be able to tell the difference. Do you get to park in the handicap spot in parking lots? 
Uh, yes, but that's because I'm retarded. Oh, okay. <laughs> we can't say that word. That's inappropriate. Oh, shit. We're getting canceled. We're getting demarked. All right. Talk about retards. Jay crashed his bike. Oh, <sighs> Jay, Rod, Jay, yeah. Jay, Jay. So... Jay. These I feel, guys, I feel uh, partially responsible. You are. <laughs> no, Dude, no, no, no. Listen, no, no. Let, let's tell the story. So one day, actually, no, no. For as maybe, soon as you guys made the decision to bike, every one of us told you, like, you're going to get hurt. Stop. You're going to get hurt. I think that's probably why it happened because you guys said that those we put it into the things, universe. <laughs> like, they think we're going to get Dude, hurt, so we're going to Maybe for, like, two weeks, Nikki Rod was like, bro, I'm obsessed with mountain biking. That was months. It was two, no, 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 two months. Listen, listen. Maybe, like... Two weeks or two months, whatever. He's like, I'm obsessed with mountain bikes. I'm like, bro, you don't even have a mountain bike yet. He's like, yeah, I know. I'm just watching a bunch of videos until my mountain bike comes in. Gets a mountain bike for like freaking few thousand dollars. And then I'm like, dude, you're going to end up getting hurt. He somehow convinces his little brother, Jay, J-Rod, to also get a mountain bike. And then Jay crashes, break, breaks his collarbone. It's and basically now, you destroyed now your little brother's It does collarbone. seem like I, I'm <laughs> you are the culprit. <laughs> yeah. He did surgery. Yeah. Pretty much I got the I got, I got the mountain bike when Jay was like – Jay wasn't here. He, what was he doing? Maybe he was at, he was at home and staying with mom or something for a little bit doing where like seminars safe. and shit. Yeah, where yeah. he was safe. You wouldn't be mountain and, biking. You know, I'm a hyperactive active person, so I would always need like something else to like settle – ease my mind right so like jits is great but i'll do jits like you know twice a day like every other day so on the on the second day of the week i need something else something fun something uh, that boosts that adrenaline adrenaline a little, that a little need, dangerous right? a little dangerous yeah. right i like something that takes like a little bit of skill that not many people can do so like mountain biking is fun right it's pretty safe if you stay on the ground but once you start jumping there's Maybe. a risk. There's heavy yes. risk involved, right? Oh yeah. And my thing was, I was, uh, you know, I I've jumped like dirt bikes and stuff. I I rode, I rode motocross for for a little bit, so I understand like you know the the dynamics of like being in the air and controlling and having you know bodily control in the air. So like me jumping, I'm like I'm I'm doing fine, and then J Rod kind of like get, gets into it. And, um, you know, he, he doesn't have m as much uh, time in the air as, as I do. And, like, maybe I have, like, 50 hours or so of, like, like you know, being, like, focused on, on learning how to jump properly. And J-Rod just kind of jumps into it. And it's too easy. Like, it's such an adrenaline uh, adrenaline boost when you land, like, a jump. And it's, like, you get this high uh, raise in confidence. And you're, like, fuck, let's do, let's do it again. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, like, there's a few aspects that, to play, that played in part. Like, us being... A bit fatigued because we, you know, we trained jiu jitsu first. Then we did an hour of like hard pedaling before, um, before we started jumping. So we probably should just went home anyways. But uh, yeah, we were like we we're just riding around this track and hitting, hitting these simple jumps. And like J Rod hits a jump that he's hit like a hundred times, and just like kind of wasn't completely engaged in the in exactly what he was doing. Like some of his attention was like, he was kind of like chatting towards well, he me. He said he was talking to, to you, right? <laughs> yeah, he, he was, was like talking <laughs> shit. Fuck you, stupid. Yeah, the sequence of, <laughs> of events, the sequence of events was like, Jay comes down this hill, goes up a hill, and like after you go down again, there's another jump. He gets to the top of the hill, he looks at me, he was like, dude, this whole time I thought I was bad at mountain biking, but it's actually I had a shitty bike. Now I have a great bike and I'm fantastic he and he's saying there he's saying this as he's going down the hill to hit a jump and he's he so hits happy he he's hits like on jump, top of the world smile on his face and lands and just fucking crashes it <laughs> oh those collar going man. Out. so yeah well, I mean you gotta be gotta be sharp when you're out there so yeah. I asked him I was like should we just sell the bikes get rid of them and he was like nah maybe we just don't jump anymore I was like uh, so that's the end oh, of so this. are you he's done gone? you think you're done or if he said yeah you'd be done with mountain biking too no you gotta learn your lesson, bro. I, I mean, I learned what not to do. You'd be better at jumping. Yeah, you learned from his stupidity. I didn't fuck up. Yeah. You know, I'm good. <laughs> it's a matter of time is working against you, bro. I mean, we ah. do dangerous shit all the time. What you don't? I've I've been riding bikes longer than I've been doing jits. <clears throat> I think you'll be fine. Just don't go too crazy. Yeah, yeah. I just I I, I mitigate my risk. Like I I, yeah. I kind of understand. Like it's just about like how much time you have doing those certain things. You know, you, it's hard for you to understand because you're not really athletic. Yeah. Like when you're a superior <laughs> athlete like me, <laughs> it's okay to yes, it's okay yes. to it's okay to dabble in different things. You know. Yes. Like I can I'm, I can I'm fucking a two sport athlete, I can, bro. Yeah, but if you're two, I'm ten. 
jujitsu. I, I get snowboard. I, you ever, I you, snowboard. You never seen me in rollerblades before. I get it done. <laughs> yeah, there's no way your ass is falling on rollerblades. Falling. I'll, be, I'll beat you in a rollerblade and an ice skating race. You you couldn't beat me in. I beat a I beat you in a foot race too. Wow. You could Puerto Rico. I beat both of you guys no, in a foot. Not no, true. you did it. Not true. Yes. Camera that cut was off. A, yeah. Cam- no, camera did not cut off. You had, head, wait, wait. You who, had a head who start. Who wins? Who wins? Ice skating. Oh, race. So I'm smashing. Me? No. It doesn't matter. You. Uh, if we I, get that there's I, guaranteed I you in, there's ice skating rinks somewhere. Yeah, yeah I'd beat you in an ice skating rink you know, with, 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 with cleats on, not even ice skates. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's probably... Like, no, 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 no. Ice skating, I will still beat you with you on cleats. Wait, you think you could sprint like in a hundred no, meter? You're, you're going to go nowhere. <laughs> no, with, with cleats, with like spiky cleats. Baseball cleats. Yeah. Auto don't spikes. Know. No, no, no. You don't I'll, think so? I'll take the ice skates that are meant for ice. <laughs> but what if you're not that? Good? <laughs> okay, what if I like think, I think like what an amateur Mickey ice skater versus like a decent sprinter who wins in a oh, race? Amateur, dude, you don't you don't see you don't realize like people are so bad at ice skating. Like they'll try to run with ice skates. And it's like not gonna work. All right, so, so the cleats guy wins. Maybe cleats saying. wins against an amateur. But now I don't think. You will stop. I don't think you know how to stop. I do a Q little hockey. circle. Q hockey stop. <laughs> I know. Q-hook. I can even. I can scoot up like 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 the little frost. You know what I mean? <laughs> can you do? Okay, frost. that's what that. <laughs> like that. Yeah, I the, don't think so. Yeah. <laughs> I think you're <laughs> that <laughs> Go straight through the through the fucking uh, borders. Oh, when you stop. You guys would play hockey growing up. Yeah, yeah we, I, used to, we used to play. Oh uh, shit. We used I, to play growing up. I played the roller hockey. Uh, not not ice, but I know how to ice skate. I can ice dance. I can do it all. Bigger oh, skate, skate. Yeah. <laughs> ice, oh, dance. ice dancing. <laughs> Wait, um, yeah. brothers getting their brothers hurt. Can we bring this up? Uh, yeah, we <laughs> can talk about this. All right. So, well, yeah, look, that wasn't that. It was yours. Was more your fault than mine was my fault. Uh, I mean, mm. say, it seems like you're in denial. No, I mean, it was probably, we'll probably blame it on somebody else. <laughs> blame it on someone named Flag Flown. <laughs> Flag yes. Flown? Let's say that. All right, so Schmink the video is going to come out eventually, but uh, there is a certain match. Well, I guess I can't ruin it because the match is going to no, be No, no, no. It's not going to ruin it. you got to say it. Just give an outline. Yeah, there was, like a, there was a match that occurred, and Liam was maybe or maybe not hurt via ACL <laughs> tear. Tear. It breaks my heart. Oh, break. I hate it. There's a video of it, and it's just brutal, and I hate it, and uh, it's sad. It's sad seeing your little brother get fucked Bro, up. Bro, when know? Jay was falling, I was like, I was like, <laughs> he got up, and I was like, I thought you were gonna roll. I thought you were gonna roll out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. You didn't roll out. <laughs> he didn't tuck and roll. He's like, I'm yeah. sorry. He, he, <laughs> smashed, <laughs> he smashes to the ground. He tries to stand up, and his arm like just he just like couldn't push it's off just the ground. Yeah, just oh. yeah, yeah, it was bad. No, but bro, he, how bad was the pain? Was he saying, bro? I don't know. He he's a fucking dog. He don't show. He was like, he's like, yeah, yeah. My I was like, I, the, the reaction, yeah. yeah the doctor's like, uh, what's your pain? One out of ten. He's like, negative, <laughs> negative ten. She, like, the, all right, she what was are you like, doing? He's tears in his eyes. She was like, do you want a? Uh, he, oh, she was like, hey, you gotta take this pill. She was like, hey, you gotta take this pill for the pain. He's like, absolutely not. He's no, like, is there caffeine in here? No. <laughs> Jay, oh, yeah, Jay Rod refuses Jay's, to yeah. drink caffeine. Jay, yeah, no coffee. Coffee. He used to have all the sugar. Remember the trolley days? And he, I, yeah. he I broke took full credit for taking him out of talking about that. He's a lot healthier now. Yes. He used to he used to have like explosive, explosive diarrhea. Diarrhea, yeah, bro. <laughs> like you remember oh, really? ADCC? Oh wow, I, I was actually joking. That's that. Oh my god. So ADCC <laughs> trials. <laughs> trials. So we're all in this Airbnb. And um, I'm like sleeping on this air mattress in the living room, and uh, it's maybe like 3:30 a.m., maybe 4 a.m. And somebody goes to the bathroom, and I just hear, and it's dead silent because everybody's sleeping. I just hear a machine gun fire. It sounds like Sloppy Joe just hitting the toilet. <laughs> I was like, oh my god, man, what the fuck? This, is this person, I didn't know who it was. This person goes back to the room. I was like, oh, wow, that was horrible. Maybe it took him like 15 minutes. <laughs> Comes back maybe like another 30 <laughs> minutes later to do it again. Same velocity and shit. And I'm like, gang oh, violence my in the God. Area. And it happened maybe like three times or four times wow. in a span of like an hour and a half. Right? So just back and forth. I wonder if Jay Raw is just like, this is normal human life. Dude, <laughs> this is apparently normal. It's this normal. is just Dude. how people defecate. <laughs> I suppose. Oh, my God. 
And then uh, I fucking wake up, and I was like, dude, somebody was shitting. And J-Rod's like, yeah, that's me. I had my morning shits, yeah. bro. What's wrong? <laughs> yeah. What? Four you don't uh, machine like, gun shit three times like, every morning? You need a colonoscopy, bro. <laughs> like, you need to figure out what's going on. Colonoscopy. Oh, shit. I remember, I'm sure this happens to a lot of babies, but I remember when Jay was a baby and still in diapers, he, like, must have shit in his pants and then sat down, and it just goes <laughs> straight up his back. Like, oh, shit. Oh, back yes. covered in shit. <laughs> yes. Fuck. Uh, same, oh. yeah. Liam used to shit green. <laughs> oh, what? Bro, I remember our dog, our dog, Max, would, like, Anytime Liam had to get his diaper changed, uh, he would follow them into the room because to my dog, it's like a it's delicate, food. A delicate <laughs> It's like, mm, barely it's digested cheap. titty milk. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> so he'd go in there and like do everything. He would like wait and just be nonchalant. So like everyone would leave the room, take that diaper and just go to town on it. Oh, it was so God. disgusting. Oh my God. Yeah, that was... Uh, about the same shade of green as that coffee. Oh, right there. Dude, my dog yeah. does shicey stuff like that sometimes. Like if he thinks he's home alone, yeah, right. Yeah. Like uh, they'll start fucking around more. Yeah, yeah. Like like he didn't like Leo, my my dog. He didn't. <laughs> we all left. Me and my girl left, and uh, Jay was home in in his room, and Leo, my dog, didn't realize that Jay was still home. So I closed the door, and. J. Rod tells me like five seconds later, he hears this ruckus going on in his bathroom. So he said the second I closed my I closed the door to the house, my dog just went to the bathroom and destroyed. He like pulled the curtains out from the, from the fucking He's like, I'm home alone. the trash can just shook in everywhere. It was just pointless shit. I wonder. I saw he's busy. He's I want, working. He's, 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 he's redecorating. Look forward to that. He's like, yeah. I got something for you. You want to leave me home? No. I wonder if it was like <laughs> if it's it's pretty. Is, it, is it? Do you think he wants to have fun? He's like, oh, I want to have fun. Or is it like these motherfuckers left me at home? These bitches. I think I'm he's just be- like, I know I can't do this. Someone's gonna stop me if they could. Yeah. So I'm just gonna go fucking crazy. Do you think he's throwing a temper tantrum, or you think I, he's I think it's fun? to be spiteful because and when I was in in wow. North Jersey, we had I had that trash can like a normal trash can right next to the door, and I always put it in a room so he didn't like knock it over and i just tested it out one day i was like what happens if i leave this right so i cl- i leave i leave the house i close the door and i put my ear to the door and i hear boom he just he <laughs> runs up at the second i close the door and just knocks over the trash can for no reason i open it and he's looking at me he's like oh i didn't i fucked up <laughs> you could see that he's yeah. like oh shit you got yeah. me you could see it in his face he's like i'm guilty yeah he's a, is- he's a bit leo's a bit spiteful too like i remember yeah. when he was a, a pup he was like six weeks old or maybe eight weeks old I'm like, you know, I'm in the midst of potty training him. I get him like a, like a, a little fence, or what, like a baby fucking fence to yeah. stay in, right? So I'm like, ah, oh, just look at it. What are you doing? We're podcasting. You're making coffee. You fucking scumbag. This, this one cup of coffee wasn't good enough for you? How dare he? I can't. I'll be right there. It's okay. This, right. is why, this is why we're in my apartment, so we can do bullshit like this. <laughs> People with their headphones. This fucking guy. <laughs> <laughs> R.I.P. Headphone users. Wow, guys, I'm really sorry for our uh, our co-host. Well, the professionalism is unparamount. It's gonna take five minutes to brew coffee. I can't believe a hu- you had a, a whole cup of coffee. It wasn't good enough for you. It wasn't. I love the decision making though. It took him one. He's like, I'm out of coffee. Yeah, fuck it. <laughs> Bro, that's crazy. I need something to drink. You sip some water. I do need water. I I couldn't bring my Yeti in because I had to bring in the cameras because. We don't have no lenses. It's crazy because I brought we the cameras, cameras up the and then I went back down and got my Yeti. That's, that's crazy. Is that what you did? I mean, we didn't, We were running late. One second. I was here early. It's okay. Yeah, we'll just wait for we'll just wait for Danny <laughs> to make his coffee. Take, no rush here. No rush here. Just chilling. This Almost is good. There. Yep. Almost but What there. do you guys think of my fridge contents? Waterloo's good choice. Yep. That's aspartame in there. Aspir- no, no aspartame. Just Quest? natural no, no. essence. That's just sparkling water. Just water that sparkles. Uh, but you know, uh, Quest, Quest bars, I'm not a fan. They're Quest cookies. Yeah, still not a fan. Okay. All right, guys, we're, we're back, right, from, we're back. From, from break. This fucking guy. Don't for, worry. I don't understand how how necessity was that coffee. It's how how ne- necessary? How what's necessity? How necessity? How, what's the difference? A necessity is a noun. Necessary is uh, ooh. But you got it, the point across. How did you have an adverb? Yo, wait. I do you guys like? Do necessary. you think you're addicted to coffee? Caffeine. Damien is to no. caffeine. No, no, no. I like it. 
I, you know, you're addicted to it. You, yes, immediately. But the question is me and Nikki Rod. You're, look at you. Yeah, you, could, you couldn't go 10 minutes without a coffee. I could have. I just didn't want to. You finish That's what addicts it. say. <laughs> yes, <yeah>. Exactly. <laughs> no, I no, stop I, I definitely I want. drink um, the most caffeine, I think, probably on the team. Really? Yeah, I, I mean, I, I definitely enjoy coffee. I, uh, I like it more after practice, but it's definitely a, a good nostalgic taste good. Good nostalgic. <laughs> is it? Does it remind you of the, uh, what? The good old days. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's, that's what I'm wondering. I mean, it what reminds you, me of a, a, a nice calm about. morning, you know. Yeah, it, it does. It makes me, it, it's just, it's relaxing for me. It's like I have time to drink a coffee. Also, I get a headache if I don't drink coffee. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I swear, yeah, guaranteed. Here, so. What's um, this? One of our uh, fans had a question. So, you know when we were talking about PDs like steroids, grease. Coffee. All the stuff you do. Yeah, yeah. Food, water. What do, you, <laughs> what do you guys think about Adderall? Yeah, that's a PED for sure. I mean, actually, It's not good know. for gains. I'm, I don't know. Adderall's not it, good for gains? Why? Because it, it stunts your uh, – or suppresses your hunger? Suppresses the appetite. You need to huh. eat a lot of food. It'll also like, bo- kill your boner. I, I, don't, I never had a problem with that. You, you take Adderall? He's like, I never yeah, take Adderall. Yeah, I never take Adderall, though. <laughs> but I've, I've had, I, yeah, I, took, I was prescribed it in uh, junior and senior year of, uh, high, of school? high school. Yeah. Really? What? Yeah, bro. Adderall, Adderall? Was so, it was so, like, check this out. So freshman, pretty much all of my uh, schooling, I, I was like a, a DC, DF kind of guy, right? Hey. So yeah. freshman. No, not me. I mean, I'm. No, no. no. really? Yeah, so, oh, so what? Not, <laughs> so freshman stupid. year, uh. Freshman, sophomore year, I, I studied pretty hard and took tests and shit. I'm just always like fucking – was like a, a D kind of guy. And then junior, senior year, they were like, listen, we got to change this shit. So they put me on – they uh, prescribed me Adderall, and I went from studying and failing went to, to D plus. <laughs> no, no. I went, I, went, I went from all Ds to – I had you no know, uh, straight A's and A's and B's junior, senior year. Just, just, and I wasn't even studying uh, at all. What, you don't believe it? No. He doesn't believe you. I mean, you're not, yeah. it was not for you to believe. You got straight A's. Straight A's, one, one, one marking period, and A's and B's all of junior and senior year. Th- he's saying thanks to Adderall. Yeah. Right. Think okay. about it. I was, I was, I was actually studying, reviewing papers, and trying hard on these tests, so, uh, freshman, sophomore year. And then I take, take Adderall, and junior, senior year, I don't have to study a fucking bit, and I just remembered whatever was going on in okay. class. Shit. Well, so, but immediately, another, immediately after high school, I got off it because I was like, it's not like I, I never eat it's any like dull, dull personality. So wait, it kills your yeah. appetite? Kills your appetite for me. Killed personality, and I was just super calm and dull all day, which no bueno. No bueno. No bueno. Yo, no bueno. Uh, Eddie Cummings, I think, used to take Adderall and Ritalin. Dr- oh, Ritalin. Well, Ritalin. he would take – yeah. Well, I don't know. I don't know. Okay, one of those, and he would drill technique for like eight hours straight, something like that. I don't. That's what I. I don't recall. Know. So like yeah, Mike I think he also Mechie saying he drills twelve hours a day. He, yeah, Did you hear that? Without, I mean, he also says he eats seven thousand calories a day. I don't buy that. That's a I mean, lot. If he, if a he's lot smashing of, a couple of pizza, pizzas, I mean, I, he's burgers, mainly carbs, so, right? Yeah, he's, he's mainly a carb yeah, guy. Yeah, dude, but you're not. I think to answer the question, calories, yeah, it, it could be uh, like learning enhancement, but not like physicality no, no, no. enhancement. I think um, right? it's like in athletic performance. So it's like not. Consistently, but say you take Adderall before competition, and now you go compete. Do you I think, think you should I don't compete know. how you train. If you're if you're training on Adderall, then yeah. compete on Adderall. But I mean, um, I don't know how that would help you. You know, maybe it helps your attention span. But I mean, you're the only one out of us who's done Adderall. So I mean, would you feel like that would be a well for me? Boost? It's different because a lot of people that do Adderall, they they don't have ADHD. Like I had ADHD, so for me, Adderall calmed me and made it me made me what, fucking yeah, boring. Yeah. But, but if you're if you're like at a normal attention level, then maybe it'll just fuck yeah. You I mean, it might it might hype you up, you know, for competition. Maybe. Why not? What's going on here? You you got so much going on. It's just, uh, this is espresso, so I'm making an Americano. Ah, uh, because you're American. Water. Yeah. Oh, I fucked up something. No, it's okay. <clears throat> but does it uh, keep the water hot? It does. That, that is a, it's like a, an electric kettle, right? It is. Damn. Boils it. It does. Soiled it. But, um, yeah, Adderall. so, overall, I don't know. bro don't science, you guys think, uh, Adderall won't help athletic performance? I, Adderall, I don't know. Just do steroids. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> just, it's, it's, try to try to true. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> what do you, don't, don't mess with the system. All right? They figured it out. It's simple. Yeah, do what works, right? Yeah. There's that. Huh? <laughs> There's that. Yeah. There's that. What do you guys think of that slap stuff? 
I think it's uh, I think it's guaranteed CTE. Yeah. But it's very entertaining because it's like I want to watch it. It's like I the best really... part of fighting is the people getting hit with the haymakers and it shit. It skips and they're, all the nonsense. <laughs> they're like, listen, we have a we have a perfect plan. You're gonna get, you're gonna punch at somebody that can't move at all. So I, I love get it. it. I'm like, th- why had this not been mainstream sooner? Like of all the years of human existence, yeah. you hit someone and they hit you back, and you end all the. Dodging and all the bullshit <laughs> you're know, doing. I'm Come on, he's faking and there's, kicking. There's just, minimal. What's the only technique is, is clinch your jaw when you're getting hit and you know slap properly. I and guess hope for the best. Yeah, yeah literally. It. Like maybe strengthening neck muscles to to stop you get from getting knocked out. But it's like there's very minimal oh, like things you can do technically and do what tactically to like yeah. be better than it's just technically you can you can. Increase your strike, right? Yeah, strike you can force, practice what you like. But it's like, like uh, to receive, it's like. Do they just use the chalk so it looks better? There's like a big poof. <laughs> Maybe. Right? Maybe if you don't use chalk, it like Maybe. it could cut cuts you. you cuts no, you I feel like the chalk gives you grip, so it's more likely to cut. You think so? Mm-hmm. Fuck, dude, the whole thing is. Just you ever, you ever seen anybody that punches no. and they're like, they're like, they're like twist their punch? I mean, no, you're, you're like, supposed you're supposed to really, yeah. yeah. Like when you if end. you if you can hit and twist, you like you can rip skin as you like boom. You know. Is that real? No, 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 no. no. Yeah, that's not the point. Point. It's like <laughs> that's no, not that's point. not true. It's like it's like, a, it's like it's like a whip. So it's like at the tail end of your strike, you're supposed to whip over to tear the skin to, to, no, tear, to tear the yeah. flesh. Yep, to tear the flesh off the velocity. So who's right? I'm oh I'm left handed. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so you can't be right. I'm a bit envied that. Are you actually so left-handed? Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, I do a lot of things both, wow. but uh, I'm lefty is the main goal. I think Liam, my brother, was going to be left-handed, and then my mom was like, "No, I'm gonna train him to be right-handed." <laughs> I swear, because because it's like it's just easier to go about life if you're right-handed. Apparently, like everything is designed for right-handed people. My so, my dad I, said uh, his his yeah. mom did that to him too. He was like originally yeah, left-handed, and thing. his mom was like, "No, nah, that's no, no, no. Yeah, it's too much. Don't be a pain in the ass." <laughs> yeah. no, <laughs> there's right. something good about being left-handed. There's yeah, uh, they have bigger brains, smarter, smarter, think. Guys. smarter people. Yeah, B- bigger hearts, bigger yeah. hearts, heart murmur, <laughs> <laughs> heart defibrillation, or whatever the fuck. All right, any other questions? Or does no one we else got, care about this thing? We got thing? a few, but... Um, are they ridiculous? How many cups of coffee you drink a day, Damien? Me? Uh, probably three. Two to three. Oh, you just I'm, had, you I'm just way had three you. here. No, no, no. Two to three. Did you have one you all the way driving here? No, no, no. Maybe... I don't know, because I usually have one before. I have one in the morning. I just woke up late today. Uh, maybe I have one on the way to training, and then one after training, and then uh, maybe three. Oh or four. wait, so you wake up coffee? Why is your driving coffee, and then uh, right after? Well, I how, much, up, how much coffee do you think fits in here? How many cups? Four. Four. <laughs> 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 maybe. Okay. Uh, I would say three. Three. Maybe four. That's a good guess, actually. Okay, then I probably it's have like, like the accurate answer. Five cups a day, if that's the case. Holy shit! Yeah, like this is a lot. Do you feel dry? Huh? You feel dry? I feel like... It- no, that's not true, by the way. Bro, I thought I was thinking true. about this. No, no, no. You ever sip coffee and be like... It's not true. <laughs> yeah, I know you know it's not true, too. <laughs> it's true, it's true. No, no, no. You are right, you are right. Aha! Two versus Were you yeah. pointing at me? <laughs> <laughs> this guy. No, so um, you're saying because it's a diet. If you just take a caffeine pill, it will. But if yeah. you drink coffee, the water itself negates hydrates Listen, you yeah. more than it I don't care you. I don't go by what the doctors say I go by how, how, how I feel, I, feel. I, I do feel I will say I do feel dry like I feel like I need water if I drink all coffee, the all the people that are telling you it coffee doesn't dry you out they're also selling coffee that's good that's a good point all those doctors are also oh, they're, <laughs> they're selling <laughs> coffee <laughs> yeah. Yeah. all those double so, blind studies um you your point is that you think coffee dehydrates you uh, I wouldn't say dehydrates you, but it doesn't it hydrate dries you out. <laughs> Makes it dries you like you a out. desert. It dries you dehydrate out. you. Yeah, yeah. It, no, no, it doesn't dehydrate, but it don't hydrate. It definitely <laughs> so dries it you did, out. Like doesn't <laughs> hydrate. So you could say like dehydrate. It dis, <laughs> dishydrate. It dis, Dude, dishydrate. He goes, he goes, he's like, it doesn't dehydrate you, but it doesn't hydrate you, but it definitely dries you out. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, long yeah. story short. <laughs> Well, the opposite of hydrated. I'd say. <laughs> okay, okay, it's dehydrated. For those yeah, days. no, it, def- definitely. If I if I do two cups of coffee, I'm like I need two gallons of water for sure. Two drops. Two gallons of water. That's it. 
I ha- okay. How much water do you guys drink a day, bro? When you're I'm, not water loading and everything, so no like creatine, gallon, gallon and a half with creatine, probably two and a half, three. Okay, wow. Yeah, I'm probably yeah. like a gallon, a little over a gallon, maybe. I yeah, feel like a gallon. Same. Somebody like you lasts you a week or so. Yeah, fuck we're like you. Fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> oh, because we're small. Fuck you. <laughs> 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 lasts you a week or so. No, I drink probably like a gallon. I have a lot of water lose, like. Waterloo, <laughs> you lose a lot of water. <laughs> Bro, that's not that good. Waterloo is amazing. No, they're good. They're so good. Good for you? Absolutely. Just sparkling water. Sparkling water. Fucking, Bro, you hear that cancerous. like sparkling Smart water, water. carbonated uh, water improves uh, muscle endurance. It it improves your ability. Yes, it you, improves. We seriously take a look at our Urban Dictionary. What's going on here? No, he's on it. Okay, <laughs> this is what happens. It helps you keep your. Uh, blood from getting too acidic from lactic acid buildup. So put, put carbonated, carbonated water. Yes, that's, that's right. That's see how see how much my friends doubt me now. Soon, thanks to my trusty brother. associate brother, we will. What does it say? That'd be so. It stops your blood from getting acidic. It doesn't stop it, but it helps balance the pH. Well, because of... he's acidic Jew, so he has to balance it. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I'm too acidic. <laughs> <laughs> it's a balance. Yeah, Liam's looking confused. It says it's just that everything. Fuck, is this is not promising. Don't, wor- don't worry, it's it's not bad for you. So it's like it sounds like uh, it's bad. I'll do this myself. Hold on. Maybe I think of sodium bicarbonate, which is <laughs> <laughs> sodium bicarbonate. <laughs> um, <clears throat> muscle. Yeah, it's just saying it has. There's nothing about that. Oh, oh, really? Sodium bicarbonate has been shown to improve muscular endurance and time to exhaustion. <laughs> I didn't realize that was carbonated water. <laughs> it is. Sodium bicarbonate. Is carbonated water? Yeah, but you're talking about like large doses of sodium bicarbonate. Oh, I There's am like in a room of negativity. <laughs> <laughs> I swear we're, to God. Negativity but, when, when, is when we were doing pull-ups and Damon's like, Oh, somebody's gonna fall, get hurt, and thirty and seconds he, later, somebody fucking you did like a backflip off of the, yeah, off the, yeah. You, yeah Damien's you like, oh, someone's really gonna get hurt, and then Damien's like, do a muscle up, and he, goes, and the guy just told me, I'll send you the, the link. We should include this maybe in the podcast. Oh, the, the link, link of the guy. Oh, yeah, oh, not the link of the guy. Um, wait. So, uh, the the way you make soda water is through sodium bicarbonate baking soda. I'm pretty sure that's the how they do it. So what do they? Do? They put baking soda in your drink. You're drinking but baking I soda. I think no, it's just it's not it's, the same as plain basic. carbonated water. Ah, fuck. Yeah, it's it's. Yeah, I think carbonated water is cheating. I wouldn't do it. I would honestly. I, per, I personally wouldn't trust anybody that's that drinking carbonated water. So. Yo, yeah. <laughs> yeah, they're too bubbly. The still, effective dose of sodium bicarbonate has to be two grams. So That's is a lot. There two gra- is there two thousand milligrams of salt in that tank? I'm not two salt. Thousand. Sodium, sodium, by- sodium, by- sodium so- yeah. See, I agree with that. Sodium is good for you, though. Sodium. Salt it up. Yeah. yeah. <sighs> not so about people right. well, are electrolytes. I don't know the full answer. Maybe our listeners can tell us if there's some truth to that. But I heard it somewhere, and I thought it was reliable. But you know, my friends come in here and just tell me I'm stupid. Real quick, so. make sure to like and subscribe. Um, to the Simple Man Podcast if you enjoy this content. want to just throw that reminder out. And if you don't enjoy it, like and subscribe anyway. All right? Yes. Because it it's good. Out. And yes. you're wrong. And if you're interested in sponsoring the podcast, make sure you DM one of us. Yeah, we need lenses. <laughs> yeah, we need lenses. <laughs> bad. Yeah, we got this. We got our cameras, no lenses, all right? We need some lenses, y'all. Yeah, we need so. fucking lenses. We got tripods that are, oh, I don't know. They, they, they got three legs. Right. I don't know if they're good. Get the job done. Yeah, you sure? Look at this thing. No. We don't even know if this thing is level. She's about to fall over. I know. She, le- well, she leaned a little bit. Yeah. No, nah, that's good. Oh, she good. Don't, she? don't trust the best buyers. Oh, that's all I'm saying. Yeah, they really, they swindled you. They swindled me. I wish I saw that interaction so badly. <laughs> like, Bro, I was like, I, I got it all figured out. Give me three. And uh, He was like, listen, they do not have lenses. <laughs> He's like, all He's right, like, fine. All right, you got me. It's fine. Buy me Sold. three. Sold. I went yeah. in there with a whole list of questions. I'm like, this is going to be, it's going to be good. Was it? Fuck. Well, you guys working on something specific in training now? Training, um, wall wrestling back, for me. Backside triangles. Yeah, um, well, what is that like called in Japanese? Senkakus. Oh, what's a back? What's a back triangle? Yoko side, side triangle. What's a back triangle? Rear. <laughs> in Japanese. In Japanese. I speak American. 
Uh, okay, okay. No, it's a, it's a Senkaku. It is a Senkaku. Yep. There's a type of Senkaku. There's a type of Senkaku called S- 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 the Pearl Harbor. What is it called? Oshiro. Oshiro. Super Senkaku, if you want to be yeah precise. What are you working on? Just anything. Just the Kaku part? No, what am I working on? I'm still working on wrestling, hand fighting, getting to the back, claw yeah. grips. Claw grips. I'm working on my claw grips. Yeah, for me, it's it's a lot of wall wrestling. But um, I don't know what I'll be working on after this fight. I mean, I still definitely, wall wrestling is going to be the biggest thing that I need to work on grappling wise. But we but, still have trials in like maybe like eight months. Yeah, or hopefully so. well, I, have trials yeah, I don't, but who knows? Yeah. Who knows? They're talking about, oh, are you guys doing those opens, ADCC opens? I might pop in and see what's up. Like, not like, going to do them? Go in. No, go. Go. Why the fuck would I do an open? It's good practice, good competitive experience. No. no. I might as well do an IVJJF. No, I would say an open would do more, especially to potentially to, get you an invite. I'm going to have to, no, opens do not. You don't think so? You smash through an open with a bunch of subs on UFC Fight Pass. They're what? blowing it up. No, it's literally just an IVJJF. It's an open. Anybody, anybody and their grandmother's gonna be there. So it'll be an easy win. Fucking like, <laughs> oh my god! I'm not, no, I'm not gonna fly. Then fucking. Oh, play. I'm too good for the opens. Ooh. All right, why don't you do the Austin Open? It's this weekend. That's literally IVJJF. Yeah, why don't you do it? No, because that's not pertain. That's not He's the rule set that I'm aiming for. I need practice in ADCC. Ah, uh, so you're gonna do the opens? Maybe. <laughs> I mean, look. If there's one, there's one in, in uh, April in like right outside Montreal. I'm like inclined to do that one because it's like you're gonna have to go there and pay money to go compete. So we'll sponsor it. Yeah, but it's like all right. Fuck, fuck it. Do it. You, you can do, do it. it. I'm not doing it. All right, don't do it. What? You're, you're, you're gonna, gonna do it. Not gonna do it. It's silver medalist, man. We should do it. He doesn't need to do it. <clears throat> I have to fight people. Yeah, after after you no, fight people, I'm just gonna f- if if. If it's between actually, a fight, if you're pursuing MMA, then if I it's guess a if fight, or if it's a, between a fight, are you going and full games. MMA after this? So you just like that's all you all you care about? No more jits competition. Um, I'm still doing jujitsu. I'm gonna fucking win trials and I'm gonna win ADCC because Ethan can't win ADCC. Not when I'm around, baby. <laughs> Shit, I thought this was his year. Thought well, last year. Well, last is year. it? Yeah, last no, year. No, it is last year. <sighs> I hate losing. Oof, yeah. 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 It's, a, it's a brutal one. <laughs> yeah. It's a brutal one. We were. Well, I get uh, well, what what no no uh, say you already brought it up. We were in uh, Puerto Rico, remember? And like Gordon had decided to move down the weight class. What what did you think of that, Nikki? Oh, oh, remember? Is oh, it, when, I remember. When Gordon moved, moved we were, up. The, the team was still yeah. together. Oh no, moved up. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, the team was still, still together. together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gordon's like, yeah, I'm gonna do uh, plus ninety nine and uh, pull rank on Nikki Rod. I yeah. asked Nikki about oh, yeah. this, and Nikki Rod was yeah. like, "I'll see you on the mats, bro." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. you gonna have to fight me for it, boy. Yeah, <laughs> ain't no, yeah, nah, nah, I can't, uh, can't give that shit up. And my goal is like, yeah. for sure, goal is to win ADCC, but ultimate goal is to be the best number one pound for pound. So I gotta beat this guy anyway, you know. There you go. There you yeah. go. And that's kind of a bitch move. If somebody tries to take your weight class, the fuck out. You gonna have to fight me for that shit, bro. Yeah, you gotta have to yeah. grapple me for that. You have to grapple me, but no punches, right? <laughs> yeah, nah. No fight, punches. Fight with no punch. Yeah. <clears throat> Yeah. What what were your what was your first thought when uh, that came about? Oh, uh, I mean, I think that was one of the determining factors of like uh, you know uh, us committing to the whole B team thing because it was yeah, like we all had our own little me. individual reasons. I yeah, guess. I mean, yeah. we had obviously those like you know there's a bunch of reasons, but one of them is like you know this guy is trying to boot uh, bump up and bump me out of this weight class or force me to go down. Oh, fuck out of here, bro. Yeah, this this my my weight I class. No weight. No, I, I mean, I, 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 could make, cut. I could make the lower weight class. What, yeah. the 205 or something? Minus 215, 99, right? Wow. Yeah. I could do 215. Two, yeah. two, no, no, 217. 217, 210. Yeah, so I'm, I could do that. You know, I could probably do it at day, day 220. It's 220. It's 2.2. 220? Yeah, yeah, yeah so I walk around 130. I could do that in a couple hours. You know, like it's, that's that's easy. Oh, so why didn't you want to do it? Well, because I'm trying to be number one pound for pound. So you got to be got to be number one pound for pound. Got to be him anyway. And honestly, heavier heavyweight's probably it. Um... I consider it easier weight class. Oh, and yeah. Craig was decided to go eighty eight or decided to go ninety nine, under ninety nine. You know that so. was that was after the fact. That was because Isaac. But he saw yeah. that coming. He it predicted that. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. It it starts starts the line. Too. Yeah. <laughs> no, no I just right I just established myself in that weight class, and it's like I, um. I mean, I'm yeah, get that. You know, you fucking yeah. got silver medal your first time at uh with like a year or two of jujitsu. Year, year, fourteen months. 
Crazy, crazy, crazy. Just like a lifetime of wrestling that no one to talk about. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey. <laughs> you play no, tennis to get good at golf? I don't know. Maybe. Wait, what? Tennis. <laughs> 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 I so I don't you do you play tennis to get good at golf? Because ah, yes. you're saying wrestling and uh, jiu-jitsu have no... Oh, not no, no but some, like golf and tennis, have some. They, you both swing. <laughs> Wait, so are you saying it's... I'm, I'm, I'm lost. No, he's just saying... I don't know what you're saying. He's before. saying that the wrestling didn't really help his... That's what no, no, I'm, not, yeah. I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not saying that it didn't really... I'm just it's not, just the I'm same, not, yeah, <laughs> the same as golf. Well, I'm not going to He's fucking me up here. No, you got it. You got it. <laughs> I know okay, what you mean. You got it. I know what you mean. I know what you mean. Um... But, uh, wait, but pound for pound, that doesn't really matter what weight class you're in. Yeah, but it matters who you beat. Um, yeah. so he's saying he's got to be the best in the world. Yeah, he's going to have to face him anyway. At yeah, but some th- point. yeah, I agree. I agree. But I'm saying the logic makes no sense. I well, think <laughs> that's but, why I'm two time silver medalist. It's <laughs> my logic. <laughs> <laughs> fair enough, fair enough. Well, no, I'm saying like, because pound for pound doesn't span across the weight classes. Like, like we could well, say. Gord's number one pound for pound. So well, you beat Gordon and you're number one pound Is pound Gordon pound. considered number one pound for pound? Yeah. I think so. Shit, I mean, I don't think whether or not it's a, there's some Wait, list you, out there, he, definitely the consensus in the graphic world is that he is. Well, he's the, like, like you're he gonna, could be the best. Like, you could be the best, but not pound for pound. But he, but he is number one pound for pound. If you go, he, you got flow oh, rankings, well, yeah, he's yeah. number one? Okay, okay. Yeah, I would I mean, think it would be like... Who else has... I thought it would be like Cade 60 win, uh, win streak, 65 win streak. Oh, do you guys think the Rotolos beat... Gordon, if no, they were his if they're size. the same size, I think so. Oh, if they were the same size, so. that's what I'm saying. It's like like at that's the bigger level, you can't really, I guess. Can't yeah, really yeah, yeah. That, that's what pound for pound means. It's yeah. not like like you can be the best, like win the absolute. If they all weighed one pound, who wins? Whatever. Now, tiny little grappling event. Told us the scrappers can't count them out. Yeah. yeah, yeah, dude. It would be sick to see Jay. Uh, give it a couple of years. Jay versus let us call on Yeah, let us call a bit. Yeah, they they're like fucking. That'd be a sick style. That'd be crazy. It'd be the most entertaining match of the year for sure. Yes, yes. Yeah. Is there a flow event in Austin in March? There or not? is. in Dallas. Oh, maybe Dallas, yeah. I thought they were coming back to Austin. They keep saying that. They, I keep, I keep Dallas I believe them this time, though. <laughs> <laughs> this time are you on that card? I haven't heard anything yet. I hope so. I would like it. To be, but who knows, man? Yeah, they offer me a Mary Galley match. I'm like, yeah, let's do it. Dude, no they, did, they turned it down. How come I didn't hear about this? Well, I mean, there's, there's still you know talking numbers and stuff. I'm like, yeah, yeah let's, one, let's. What happened to Craig? Craig, <laughs> Craig <laughs> talking numbers. One one. I don't two, understand. One, three, one. Speak English. Speaking yeah. numbers. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, Craig might also have a, a match with him. I don't know if that's like signed or nothing, but uh, it's definitely in the yeah, I've heard of it in the talks. I so wonder much. if. I wonder if Marigali, uh Accepts that, Craig? No, with you. Oh me? I think he's he's probably has a, uh, I think he's a confident guy. I think he'd probably accept it. He was talking crazy shit. Yeah, with, uh, sick about Craig. Uh, uh, I think he'll talk. Okay, makes it, if, it just with, makes it more entertaining. Whatever I think if we like. have a match, he'll probably uh, talk shit and. I'll you think his, he wrestles I'll with hurt, you? I hurt his feelings. I mean, it doesn't matter. He can do. He can try whatever he wants. Yeah. <laughs> he can stand. He can sit. He can fucking. He can fly. You know, try to do a little leg locks, whatever you know. Yeah. Do what you want, bud. <laughs> well, all right. <laughs> Who do you right. think your toughest opponent is? Out there? It's usually myself, bro. Honestly, yeah. <clears throat> Beating, gotta, gotta, gotta beat the mirror. Do you ever lose to yourself? <clears throat> One time, but then I got better. I grew from it. I understand. He's he's good. He's yeah. Good. Hey. I'm scared motherfucker. <laughs> I wouldn't fuck with him. <laughs> <laughs> he scares me. He <laughs> <laughs> goes into the my, into the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> I can't go in there. <laughs> he's a <laughs> monster in there. <laughs> Man. All right, what are you guys doing at training today? What's the plan? What are you gonna work on? You gonna get in there? You gonna warm up? Me? You find someone? Um, well, I'm no, coach. I'm coaching today, so you guys, you guys missed my oh, yeah, warm up last time. Oh man, I, I walk in Wait, and warm up. He's, he has them <laughs> running laps, doing backflips. Oh, sick! Yeah, I, I just I just changed it. I was curious. I was like, who's athletic in here? Turns out, turns out, forty percent right. of our uh, of our uh, students can do can do car wheel. What percentage? Forty percent can do car wheel. Can do car wheel. No. I mean, that's actually. Good. That means sixty percent can. Yep. Carwell was like a basic staple of well, to childhood. Well, properly is actually like it's not gotta, hard. No, but to do it properly means you have some kind of like a lot of people just can't do that. I mean, I see. I made him do it uh, both sides, left yeah. and right, and it was it was it was fun. Oh, actually, Carwell's on my left we side. We should have filmed that. That would have been great content. The athleticism. Do you, do you feel? Do you feel? 
I'm uh, not cartwheel ambidextrous, if that's what you're about. Yeah, to I just realized yeah. I, I do cartwheels. Like, I can go right, right hand right. first, yeah, left yeah, hand is left. Left hand actually uh, would be, feel kind of weird. No, I could do both. I do everything. I do shots left and right. You can do backflip? I mean, I can do everything. Back, double backflip? No, no backflip. You can't. You can. well, yeah. <laughs> We've tried this. <laughs> Did we try backflips before? I can do a back I, handspring. If, if I'm on a trampoline, then definitely backflip. Oh, back trampoline. Oh, yeah, that's yeah. cheating, yeah. It's not cheating. I mean, it's just a, it's just an adjustment. It's a little boost. <laughs> you know, fair enough, fair you know who's got a springy mats? Um, Tim Kennedy in uh, in Cedar Park. He has, oh, he has his, like those judo like, yeah. mats. Well, it, yeah, there's, I, there might, I think there's springs under it because you can That's feel like. So little, oh, actually, um, yeah. yeah, Fuji does have uh, the spring floorboard. That we should can, really invest in that. Dude, I you think. should get um, either that or uh, we're getting. At my gym, we're getting foam subfloor, so it's like you get thrown and you just it feels fucking. You just awesome. bounce. Yeah. It feels yeah. awesome. No, I mean it doesn't. It feels like a fucking pillow. Right? Before, before all that, we need some uh, lenses. So please help us. Yeah, help, help us get lenses. Yeah. They're so expensive. <laughs> yeah. All right, we should wrap this up soon. Yeah. yeah all right, guys. Um, thanks for watching Simple Men Podcast. This is Damien, Nikki Rod, Ethan Grellinston. You've been simplified. You're welcome. Shout out, massive supplements. Violet Hippie. <laughs> Lincoln Bio. <laughs>